Colorful sketching with watercolors step by step. Similar to ultramarine, Lucas Cobalt Violet is a nice paint for sketching with a brush. It looks a bit warmer than ultramarine blue and suits perfect to most other colors. Here I use a small flat brush to sketch in the most important parts of my motif and already suggest light and shade areas. Next I use a bigger flat brush to fill in the first colors. I don't paint very accurate here, just suggesting colors with a few brush strokes. I always try to balance my color composition using warm and cooler colors. And of course leaving some paper white is essential for a loose watercolor. For each warm tone try to add a contrasting cooler color tone on my watercolor. This works pretty intuitive when you have some practice. I try to bring in a huge variety of brush strokes. Although I paint a picture of an abandoned house, I think more in single brush strokes and color shapes. In my eyes a good way to abstraction. The variety of different brush strokes boldly set against each other brings life and texture to my watercolor. I love to develop a motive this way because the result is always a bit surprising. It is important to think in colorful shapes more than to care too much about details. I like it when the paints mix on the paper. When I have the color mood developed on my paper I let it dry for a moment. I use a Chinese brush with a fine tip to add some lines to the building's entrance. Especially the darks should be painted brave and bold to give the sketch a vivid look. It is always good to take photos of your painting process, not only if you like to write watercolor tutorials. They always help me to review my painting process and learn more. I think it's an awesome practice to paint the same motif in different variants. I do this pretty often exploring and getting more comfy with my motif. And I always tell my students it is much more effective to practice the motif before you start the final watercolor. The better you know your motif, the more bold you can paint it later. Sprinkles of paint used in the picture before help me to add more life to my paintings because they can suggest different things like leaves, etc. To me it is important to follow the impulse right away when it appears. That makes it always exciting for me to paint with watercolors and keeps the painting process always entertaining to me because I never know exactly how, to, how the final picture will look like. I think I'm well prepared now to start the final watercolor of this scene on a good paper. The paints I use are all Lucas Watercolor 1862 24ml tubes. Cobalt Violet, Lucas Red, Burnt Sienna, Naples Yellow, Cobalt Turquoise, Cyan Blue, Ultramarine and Genuine Rose. My ebooks and e-tutorials are available at Etsy and Amazon.